Hey, my babes. I have on waist trainer and it is not uncomfortable yet. So I'm gonna see if I can make it all day. Yesterday, I told you guys that I, well, kind of jokingly, I told you guys that I wanna do an abs challenge by December 31, 2020, but I think I'm serious. I don't know if a waist trainer kind of hinders progress when it comes to getting definition in your abs and stuff like that, but I'm, I'm gonna do a little bit more research, but as of now, I think I'm going to try the waist trainer for a while, see how I feel. That's gonna be fun, that's gonna be exciting to kind of watch my progress and I think that's a goal and I was just talking about in a previous video how I can't well not I can't but kind of trying to figure out what's motivating me and what a motivator is and I think a personal challenge is a really good motivator so defined abs by December 31 is kind of a good motivator I would think we'll see where this goes with me <laughs> I used to be pretty flexible nowadays not so much as a matter of fact not at all I think one of the good starting points um, for me getting serious about fitness is going to have to be deep stretching. And I know a lot of people do yoga. So where my yogis at, drop a comment, let me know how you like it. Let me know how far you've progressed. Like, did you start off in a really bad place where you were like no good, not, not flexible at all, and then now you're into a really comfortable place where it feels natural because it is so awkward to me to try like any yoga position. I'm just, I'm the worst. I can simultaneously um, give myself a personal challenge to progress in yoga and get to a six pack um, or defined abs, whatever you wanna call it. Cause after having five kids, who knows what the heck it's gonna look like. But <laughs> I want definition in my abs. That's my thoughts for the day. I really wanna push towards that. I'm, I think that's a good personal goal. I think that's, a reasonable goal other than that diet i'm still fasting today still got joe with me i had my blue mug the last couple days i think i left it on the train those contigo mugs are like 20 dollars each and i'm pretty sure i left it on the train the day goes to my new friend and Steph and Steph said cute outfit love the outfit thank you <laughs> she also said great vlog thank you and she said she's not getting a lot of sleep either she's not sleeping well either um, sleep was one of those things that we neglect so much we neglect it so much when we're trying to lose weight and it's just as important as diet and exercise so we got to get on board y'all we got to get our sleep we got to get those hours in just like we need to get that time in working out we got to get that time in sleeping and Steph is actually working on a water fast go over there check her out she's a hard-working mom but she is like determined to lose this weight. So I believe she's doing like intermittent fasting, water fasting right now. So check her out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a comment because every day is an opportunity for you to be featured in tomorrow's video. Yes, so every day is for learning, living, and loving. I will talk to you tomorrow.